Hello, in this tutorial we are going to create a meta ball in Maya with n particles. Let's first create a particle with n particle tool. I'm going to create three point and hit enter. First we need to increase their size and then right click particle, select your individual particle and create cluster deformer and do it for the rest of the particles you can use uh, G in your keyboard to repeat last action okay now we can uh, select our cluster and move it around you can uh, change the position of individual particle with cluster let's undo this then now I'm going to create three locator in the positions of the clusters. Create locator. I'm going to hit uh, V and then middle mouse to snap the locator to cluster. Control D to duplicate and V again. Control D and snap the last particle. First we need to uh, parent this uh, locator to clusters first I'm gonna copy the name of the locator first locator select the cluster go to sh handle shape wait node and paste the name of the locator to here and press enter and then we don't need to see the uh, cluster in the viewport so go to object display and untick visibility I'm sorry we need to do it for cluster handle shape I'm going to do the same thing for the rest Okay, now we have three locator and we hide uh, the clusters. Let's convert this M particle into polygon. Modify, convert. Let me uh, press the space here so you can see it. Modify, convert. No, you, you're not going to see this. Okay, I'm M particles to polygons. Now we have uh, a mesh. If we if we select one of our locator and move it, like you see, when they uh, get close to each other, they're going to try to blend. You can uh, change the how look how, how mesh looks by changing uh, the output mesh in the uh, M particle shape. So select your particle, go to output mesh section. Uh, you can play with the uh, blobby radius scale. can also give some smoothing by decreasing the mesh triangle size you simply add more subdivision more detail to your metabol something like this so you can select your uh, class uh, locators again and we can move it around. It's a very nice cool effect. So thanks for watching.